What do we know about the early life of the influential political figure, Martin Romualdez? Born in the bustling city of Manila, Philippines, Martin Romualdez was not a stranger to the world of politics. His father was an associate justice of the Supreme Court, and so the call to public service was in his blood from the start. His early education began in his home country, where he got a taste for law and governance, but his thirst for knowledge didn't stop there. Fueled by his ambition, he journeyed to the United States for further studies. It was at Cornell University where he delved deeper into the intricacies of government, earning his bachelor's degree. Not stopping at that, he returned to the Philippines to study law at the prestigious University of the Philippines, from where he obtained his Bachelor of Laws. These formative years shaped Romualdez into the leader he would go on to become. So, how did Romualdez's political career unfold? Well, it all started with his entry into politics as part of the Lacas CMD party. This party, rooted in the principles of Christian democracy and progressivism, seemed to be the perfect fit for Romualdez, aligning with his own values and aspirations. Then, in 2007, a pivotal moment arrived for Romualdez. He was elected to the House of Representatives, representing the 1st District of Leyte. This was the beginning of a journey that would see him serving his constituency with unrelenting dedication and passion. Romualdez's performance and commitment to public service didn't go unnoticed. He was re-elected in 2010, and then again in 2013. His constituents saw in him a leader who was not just interested in politics, but someone who genuinely cared about their welfare and progress. In the House of Representatives, Romualdez didn't just play a passive role. He stepped up and took on the responsibility of being the majority leader. This position allowed him to influence the direction of legislation and policy, and he used this opportunity to drive initiatives that reflected the needs and aspirations of his constituents. But it wasn't just about legislation and policy for Romualdez. He was a leader who understood the importance of resilience, especially in the face of disasters. Coming from a region that has often been at the mercy of natural disasters, Romualdez was a strong advocate for disaster resilience. He championed measures aimed at strengthening disaster preparedness, response, and recovery. His work in this area has made a significant difference in the lives of countless people, helping them to weather the storms that life often throws our way. Romualdez's political journey is a testament to his dedication and commitment to public service. It's a journey marked by tireless service, fierce advocacy, and a deep-seated desire to make a difference in people's lives. And it's a journey that continues to inspire and motivate, reminding us all of what can be achieved when service to others becomes a guiding principle. Where does Romualdez stand today, and what legacy has he built? Martin Romualdez has solidified his place in the political landscape of the Philippines. After his re-election in 2019, his focus has remained steadfast on the welfare of the Filipino people. He has aspirations that reach beyond his current position, with a strong desire to continue serving his country and its citizens. Romualdez is not just a politician, he's a leader. His commitment to the Filipino people is reflected in his tireless work, from pushing for important legislation to advocating for disaster resilience. In a country often racked by natural disasters, Romualdez's emphasis on resilience has been crucial. He has championed policies that prepare communities for these challenges, demonstrating his dedication to protecting his country and its people. His reputation is one of steadfastness and reliability. Romualdez is known for standing firm in his beliefs and for his unwavering commitment to his constituents. His leadership style, marked by a blend of compassion and resilience, has left an indelible mark on the political landscape of the Philippines. Romualdez's legacy is one that will be remembered for years to come. His dedication to serving his people, his commitment to disaster resilience, and his tireless work ethic have set a high standard for future leaders. He's not just leaving a legacy, he's building a blueprint for others to follow. Martin Romualdez's story is one of dedication, resilience, and a lifelong commitment to serving his people.